from their polls, it appears that uh, the center right is leading. We see one year is a long time, but uh, and then we have to see what kind of center right will be in power. Uh, who will be the prime minister? Still very uncertain. Yeah. Will the unity government hold in the meantime, though? Mr Draghi has to carry out what may be for some quarters some very unpopular reforms. I think it will hold uh, together until, uh, for sure, until uh, the, after the summer, then there may be some changes, but there, are no, there is not going to be a new government uh, before the next uh, spring. A couple more quick questions. Uh, the weather's beating us here a little bit as well. Um, what about the war? What has it done to Italy? The main problem is uh, the increase in the further increase in uh, the price of commodities. The commodity prices, gas, uh, uh, oil. The government is putting some money to muffle the impact on uh, households and uh, and firms, but of course the heat is strong. It's about it's, uh, the, the 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 additional tax that we have to pay to the producers of uh, raw materials uh, is, with respect to 2019. I'm taking 2019 because 2021 were exceptional years. Is about 80 million, 80 billion, which is like four percentage points of GDP. The government is offsetting perhaps uh, one third of this, but the rest is uh, slows down the economy. That's money that should be used on the energy transition, not on uh, offsetting rise in hydrocarbons. That's uh, inevitably what is going to happen in the short run. Unfortunately, we are subsidizing dirty energy. Uh, it's uh, something, however, that uh, should tell us that we need to move to, to we need to leave the hydrocarbon world and move to renewables. That's and for that, sure. And, and finally, as a nation, what has this war done? Has it changed the psyche of the nation? Do you think has it changed its attitude to various partners, its attitude to the EU, its attitude to defence? I'm just very interested in, in, in what it's doing to everyone's psyche. Well, the, definitely uh, the way uh, Italians look at the European Union has improved uh, since uh, the beginning of the COVID crisis. We have seen so much money, particularly from the European Central Bank, but now uh, also from the European Union. Uh, how long this will last? <laughs> we don't know. We have a, we have a very... Uh, the public opinion shifts very quickly in Italy. It has been shifting very quick in the last few years in Italy. Uh, and just uh, on that point, uh, what about... You talked about Russia going forward as well. Can it, um, Minister Todde yesterday said to me it cannot be back to normal in terms of our energy relationship. Do you think it can be back to normal in terms of a diplomatic relationship? I hope things will improve. The priority is to stop the war. What will happen later, I don't know. I think that uh, Russia remains part of Europe. It's just that now it's a very bad time for, in the relationship between the rest of Europe and Russia.